Thank you for listening to a nighttime adventure bedtime story from nighttimeadventures.com. Visit our website to view hundreds of exciting bedtime stories for children of all ages. The Nighttime Adventures of Max, The Pony Express Max was fast asleep, dreaming of all sorts of exciting adventures. Suddenly, he found himself on horseback, riding alongside a group of rugged cowboys. He looked around and realized that he was in the middle of the Wild West. Welcome to the Pony Express, Max, one of the cowboys said. We've been waiting for you, Max was confused. The Pony Express? What's that? The cowboys explained that the Pony Express was a mail delivery service that operated in the United States in the mid-1800s. It was founded in 1860, during a time when communication across the country was slow and difficult. The Pony Express was a way to deliver mail quickly, using a relay system of horses and riders. Max was fascinated and excited to be a part of it. The cowboys gave him a satchel of letters to deliver and showed him how to ride and take care of his horse. They also warned him about the dangers of the trail, including wild animals, rough terrain, and hostile Native American tribes. Max set out on his journey, riding through the rugged and unforgiving landscape of the American West. He rode hard and fast, switching horses at each relay station to keep up the pace. The trail was long and treacherous, but Max was determined to get the mail delivered. Along the way, Max encountered all sorts of challenges. He had to outrun a pack of wolves, cross a raging river, and navigate through a dangerous canyon. He also met friendly pioneers and cowboys who offered him food and shelter. As Max rode, he learned about the history of the Pony Express and how it changed communication in America. The riders were some of the bravest and most skilled horsemen in the country, and they faced incredible risks and challenges every day. Finally, after days of hard riding, Max reached his destination. He delivered the mail to a grateful recipient and celebrated with the other riders. They all gathered around a campfire and shared stories of their adventures on the trail. As the night grew late, Max knew it was time to head back home. He said goodbye to his new friends and climbed back into bed. As he drifted off to sleep, he knew that he had just experienced one of the most thrilling adventures of his life. And he couldn't wait to see where his dreams would take him next.